Let's do some questions on conversion of decimal fractions to simple fractions. Well, this is a pure recurring decimal number and you know the trick. So in the numerator we would write the number without the decimal point. So the number is 4, 4, 2, 3. Let's count the number of repeating digits which is 1, 2, 3 and 4. So there are 4 repeating digits. So in the denominator 4 times 9 would come because there are 4 repeating digits. So that's it. There's our answer. 4, 4, 2, 3 by 9, 9, 9, 9. So option B. So the number given in this question is a mixed recurring decimal fraction. Here 8 is non-repeating and 4 is a repeating digit. Because there is only one recurring digit, we would have only one 9. And there is only one non-recurring digit, we would have only one 0. So 90 is the denominator. In the numerator, we have the number without the decimal point, so the complete number is 84, minus the non-recurring digit. So the non-recurring digit is 8, so minus 8. So that comes out to be 76 upon 90. So our answer is option C. So in this question, we will first have to convert 6.426 recurring to an equivalent number and that comes out as 0 0.6426 and this 426 is recurring multiplied by 10 so the value of both the numbers is same now let us count how many non-recurring digits are there so non-recurring digits are only one there is only one non-recurring digit and the recurring digits are three there are three recurring digits so that's it now we will first find out the denominator. So in, our, in the denominator we have three recurring digits so we will have three nines and there is only one non-recurring digit so we will have only one zero. This 10 is as it is into 10. Now in the numerator we will write the number without the decimal point. So 6, 4, 2, 6 and then subtract the non-recurring digit from it. So minus the non-recurring digit is 6 so minus 6. Now this comes out as 6, 4, 2, 0 by 9, 9, 9, 0 into 10. This 0 gets cancelled out. So this is the answer. 6, 4, 2, 0 divided by 9, 9, 9. Okay, moving on to the final question. In this question you have to find out the sum of numerator and denominator. So you have been given the decimal recurring decimal number and let's first convert it to simple fraction. So we have 0 0.39 and in this 39 is recurring. So how do you convert this into a simple fraction? So it's simple. Count the number of recurring digits and the non-recurring digits. So you don't have any non-recurring digit. You have only recurring digits. So this number is 2. So in the denominator, for recurring digits, you have nines. So there are two recurring digits, so you have two nines. And in the numerator, you write the number as it is. So this is 39. Now we have to reduce this fraction into lowest terms. So we can divide both the numerator and denominator by 3. So 3 ones are 3, 3 threes are 9, and 99 is 3 threes are 9, and 3 threes are 9. So 13 by 33. So 13 plus 33. That is the sum of numerator and denominator. So 3 plus 3 is 6, 3 plus 1 is 4. So this is the sum of numerator and denominator. So option C is the correct answer.